All right, I'm gonna give you a quick video walkthrough of the brand new for 2019 model year Tierra Sport 34 Luxury Crossover Bow Rider. This boat's powered with twin 350 Yamahas, pushes the boat fully loaded with a few people, full gear, full fuel, full water to about 52 miles an hour. Uh, this rear section here is on a slider. So you release this and that'll slide forward. And there's another release for this backrest to fold down and become a full sun pad. You can adjust that to any angle you'd like. You've got a telescoping ladder under here. And then you've got a top mount ladder that can uh, attach right there as well. That has dedicated storage on the boat. Got a transom hot cold wash down. Nice boarding step coming in if you have a higher boarding area. Moving inside, there's this huge wraparound seating. This is the standard table that'll fold out. You can option that as a teak table as well. Now in the lazarette. Get the generator. And that's where the sea keeper will mount if you option the sea keeper on this boat. And there's that ladder. Drawer fridge. Freezer up top. Of course, Corian solid countertops. You have a trash can right here. Speakers loaded through the whole boat. Two, two, two. Optional cockpit TV. We have a big Yeti cooler down under the captain's helm seat. We have this raised seat, which is really nice with the bolster. We've got some nice steps down there. You have your light control to adjust the uh, multicolored lights throughout the, the entire boat. You have a, a bow thruster as well as the joystick on this boat, option with the joystick. Dual screens, again, one's a standard, second's an option. Cockpit AC with controls right at the helm. You got your Yamaha and autopilot monitoring right up top. Additional AC ports with a second control and a stereo control. Teak accents through the whole boat. A locking head, and this head is awesome. You step down in the head, you got a nice teak step. Again, Corian countertops, bunch of storage, very contemporary with the white and the grays, and then teak throughout the rest of the boat. And this is your power panel. You have a huge ski locker floor storage here. It's gotta be, I don't know, seven or eight feet long and four feet deep maybe. Uh, that's the filler cushion for the bow seating area that I'm about to show you. So this windshield is, is really nice. The windshield comes all the way up to the hard top here. We've got a system that comes down to seal this whole area off. The door. Then moving forward, got a full wraparound bow seating. That's where that optional cushion will go in. You have a big windlass step up here and access to your anchor. And this is very cool. So in the front, again, you've got locking here. This whole area flips out. So you have dedicated line storage. Then moving in, you have all of these clip systems and bungees and everything else. And this is massive. I can almost stand up in the back area back here. It's about five feet of head clearance. And all finished off extremely well. Again, solid surface down low with cup holders 
and a stereo control on either side. Again, there's that windshield. You have a extra heavy duty stainless hinge, port and starboard wipers. It's a massive hard top, open array radar. Again, there's that custom Yeti cooler. Fresh water, raw water washed out. Both seats are adjustable, of course. The uh, captain's seat is a power system. The other ones uh, will rotate over, so you can actually release that hinge and this whole system will rotate around to open up the cockpit. Kind of cool, you've got these nice stainless accents that go up through the hard top. And of course, the uh, Make Fast Sunshade with the button right where it needs to be. Complete knockout on this boat. This will do extremely well in our market.